Actually, it is kind of funny. Like the like the label sign, the one and only. Really, it's just it's such a good brown ale. It's not that heavy in uh, alcohol volume or alcohol per volume. Just goes down nice and crisp and just mm, it's refreshing. It also has like a good solid taste to it. If you leave it out overnight, it tastes, it tastes exactly the same as when you first opened it too. Oh man. There's not many new kids like that was in sixth grade actually. I, Long story short, my older brother loves Newcastle, and I stole the beer and had a sip of it. I didn't like, hate it. I remember never liking it. And last year, my buddy Peter and I went out to North Beach just like to see some foliage and stuff. And we picked it up, and that was not the first time I'd had it since, but it was definitely like a kind of revival in my palate, I guess. Like, See what happened there? There's a little nitrous ball inside the Boddingtons, very similar to the uh, the cans of Guinness. They do that and it kind of creates like a fake head like you'd be pouring it out of a draft. Ooh. The bubble's a real thing by the way, if you didn't just see that. Boddingtons. Boddingtons is definitely a, like a lot less light than uh, Newcastle. Well, good. Boddingtons is like an actual pub ale. And, uh, Newcastle's a brown ale. So it's like there's, uh, there's like differences, but they're both very, very similar. In the words of ACDC, have a drink on me. Perfect.